Uh, I think overall, um, yeah, the result is fair enough. And, uh, well, the final game here. Let's talk about that first. After four, uh, almost four very intense hours, how difficult was it to play that game? Yeah, it was tough. Uh, I was put under some serious pressure. Um, and he had, he had a pretty stable positional advantage, which he chose to, uh, to cash in um, with a concrete tactical sequence. Uh, but I'm not sure if that was uh, a good practical choice since I got very serious uh, counterplay there. Um, then, uh, yeah, later I, I just missed um, the trick of Queen A3 and then I won it Rook A2, but 96 wins for him, uh, which was a bit un unfortunate. Um, since I was uh, deciding in, between going Queen B8 and um, and queen c7, uh, but I wasn't. I wasn't so. I wasn't so sure uh, even about queen queen b8 because I, I thought he would have tricks with uh, queen d3 and then take on e6 um, and um, queen d7. And I thought probably I would have to take a draw there by taking his pawn on, on b7 in, instead. Um, but um, yeah, I just checked briefly after the game. It turns out I had I had a trick there, which won. But so that's a bit unfortunate. But um, what can you do? Did you feel that Jan was playing some serious, fearless chess today? Yeah, he was um, certainly giving it, it his all, um, and uh, yeah, that makes for for very uh, very exciting games, of course. Um, and uh, I think uh, he he saw some things for sure that I didn't see, uh, but he also also missed a few missed a few things. But but yeah, it was was a very good fight. And then uh, game three, I think it was move twenty three. You pushed uh, your pawn to a four, and that was the top computer move. But our expert was just they were just in shock that you found that move. Can you take us through your thinking behind making that move? Uh, yeah, everything else clearly just lost, so it was was an easy choice. But how did you find it? Uh, well, process of elimination, uh, trying to find any move that can sort of dig at his position. So, uh, I wouldn't, yeah, uh, as long as you sort of think of the move, it's clearly the only one that doesn't lose on the spot. Mm. And Magnus, do you feel that if Jan played maybe more fearless chess in the World Championship like he did today, that he would have stood a better chance? I think that's so really serious. <laughs> All right. Now, um, uh, the fighting chess index, I don't have the updated number, but I do have a feeling that that uh, number will shoot uh, skyrocket for both of you. Will you be eager to see uh, if you're increasing on the index? Well, I don't know how it works, but we made four draws, so... I don't know. <laughs> Fighting trolls, though. And, uh, well, uh, in the final, Magnus, one more day, one more match. Will it be more of the same tomorrow? Will we get more of this incredible entertainment? Um, we will see. Uh, I will certainly try my, my best, mostly mostly to win, of course, but um, maybe to attend to, to as well. But, um, yeah, overall, it's... Um, it's been uh, it's been a good final so far um, and uh, everything to to play for. Um, I've had some of these days as well when when it's been two two after the first day and that's all right. Um, in, in a way, it's uh, um, yeah, it just makes it more more exciting because. This means that it's just a one day, one day match. Definitely. Well, Magnus, thank you so much for the entertainment and good luck on the final day tomorrow.